Is it recording now? Yes. Okay. Hi guys, this is Mary and Valerie from Kodak Kerouac. And as we promised in the last post, we are doing sort of a intro into photography, if you will. Because I realized that when we traveled, <laughs> especially when we met up with Shannon from Dirt and Kids, we had all these cameras and she was like, what the hell cameras are those? I've never seen this in my life. Well, or this. Or that. These are Holgas, and they are our best friends. They are our best friends. We love them. They are plastic. You can drop them, which we do all the time. She did, like, right before we started recording. I've dropped mine down a waterfall before, <laughs> maybe a couple times. So, today, we are going to show you how to load film in one of these and what it is. And Mitch, show yours. Mine's black, and it's harder to see. That's the same camera, they're just, mine's black and original and not fancy, and hers is... Hollywood. That's right, this is <laughs> Oscar. Hollywood. Oscar. <laughs> um, this is Hollywood. What's your dream? <laughs> Everybody has a dream. Um, Holgas have been around for a while, but now, because it's starting to be cool to use film again, which no complaints here, hipsters are starting to take this over. Dirty hipsters. Fucking hipsters. So, mine I paid 20 bucks for, which you can't. You can go to eBay, you can go to Holga.com and get a normal Holga for 20 bucks. But if you drop your $20 Holga down a waterfall and then it rests solid, you have to end up buying another one, and you might end up with a gold one. But you might end up with a gold or a purple or a pink one from Urban Outfitters for $80? Yeah, they are 80. I don't know like, why hipsters, they are. Like hipsters, you're crazy, all right? You guys look like bums. You never shower, so I know you have money because you clearly don't buy shampoo, but you don't need to spend $80 on a camera that you can get for 20 bucks, right? Or did the wise. And if you buy the black one, you can always cover it in glitter. You can. There's nothing stopping what? you. All right, so now back to the camera. Um, it uses 120 film. Like, this is the back of it, which... Show yours. Film? Yours is gold. And oh, you can okay. Well, I like to tape mine closed. Yeah, the thing about Holgas, if you don't tape them shut, they can the back can fall off, so it's good. Which sounds like the worst way to sell a camera, <laughs> but <laughs> they're, they're really well, a little good bit tape fixes it. It's fine. So just put some tape on the back for. All right, so you open up the back. A new roll of Kodak. We're gonna do black and white this time. We're gonna do T Max, four hundred speed. It's good stuff. Gonna open that shit up. And then it's wrapped again. Child proof or adult proof. Often adult proof. Yeah, yeah. Drunken yeah. adult, don't try to do oh, this. Yeah, no. Load your camera before you drink. Alright, so it comes <coughs> like this. Okay. Whoa, so exciting. Alright, will you Vanna White? For I me? will! Oh my god. You'll feel it. it snaps in. The reason you need this extra spool is because you're going to pull it over here. It's going to catch inside there. Hold it up close. I'm holding it up close. It's going to catch inside there. And then you just turn it. And you keep turning it. And voila, there you go. Now, you the one thing about um, the Holga camera is it also has little pieces of foam behind it that kind of keep the uh, reels tight. And sometimes the foam comes out. And when the film comes out, the way you fix that is by folding up little pieces of paper and sticking them under your rolls of film. And that generates a little bit of friction, and it's just enough to keep the rolls tight so your roll doesn't get developed around the edges when you pull it out. It makes it more snug so that it's a tighter fit. And you see this arrow here, this black arrow that you clearly cannot miss? That means that you have rolled enough you need to put your back on because the film is going to start after this arrow so you put your back on your camera all right so you and then you can just ex, you'll have a little window in the back of your camera this red and you keep advancing it until you see one it, and it goes up to 12 on a normal camera on the back you have two options there's 12 and 16 which you can't see because mine's black but there's 12 and there's 16. Holga comes with two film backs and they look like this. This one is a 12. A 16 is a little bit smaller. The hole 
it's, it's a little smaller. more rectangular as well. What it means is you can either get 12 images out of a roll, or if you use the smaller 16 back, which I don't have with me, you can get 16 images out of the roll. But you don't have to use it at all. I don't use it. I just go free back. Hers is naked. Yeah. I don't like that. I love it. But it's a film. It's going to take a really long time, but then you'll start to see these arrows. Can you see these arrows? No. I don't. You can't see them on there, but all right. just well. advance it, and you know that you'll see arrows, and then you'll start to see numbers. And you stop when it's number one, and then you one. take a picture, and then you advance it until you see number two. It's pretty easy and straightforward because it right, was made so for children. I wasn't ready. Well, I don't care. No, there actually are two shutter speeds. I'm gonna put quotation marks on that. There's, there's a, not real. the cloud and then or and there's sunny, there's sunny and cloud. It, there's no difference. I've never noticed any difference. Yeah. It's slight if there's anything. It do, yeah, no, don't, so don't even don't, don't worry it's for about decoration. That. Honestly, I love you the people at Holga, but it doesn't do shit. And then um, there's also all this like focusing bullshit. Mine's on um, a mountain. Yeah, keep it on the mountain. If you're doing something real close up, maybe, like, try to get, like, oh, like, like the little family setting, you know, if I'm taking a picture right here. But for the most part, just leave it on the mountain. Yeah. It takes it, pictures of everything. Pretty much. It's, these are really easy to use. They come up with great images. I, I don't, every I love I've, my whole guy. Yeah, every role I've shot, I've had at least one Pulitzer Prize winning photo. I'm still waiting from the committee to, to get my medal. But, anyway. And now that you know what it is, when we say, oh, Valerie broke her Holga, or oh, Mary stepped on her Holga, or oh, we took this great image with a Holga, you will know what we're talking about. Holga. And to expose, we didn't know if you, there's a, that's how you do it. One click. It's super easy. And that was today's lesson on what a Holga is. Join us next time for the next camera. Yeah. You know, it'll be fish whatever. eye or brownie or SLR. We got a lot. We've got a lot from, of cameras. So. Thanks, guys.